Wow, here we go, Johnny Stewart and friends. Boy, I got a lot of friends in here and I got a lot of friends in the waiting room. I'm telling you, this is gonna be a big show today. Okay, so we're gonna be really, really excited because we have a cast of people here and some extreme producers and people that are very heavy in our business, musically and production-wise and history with the show business itself. And we're gonna really find out some nice things today. And these people have prepared a number one production show <laughs> that we are now talking to several major rooms in Las Vegas to get this thing located, right? That's right. Okay, so it's going to be a great thing. It's going to be a fun thing and talent from young to older and everyone's good looking and everything's great. Mainly you. I didn't say him. <laughs> All right. Okay. So anyway, we are very excited to be here and have a great show. Now, Asar? Yes, sir. Okay. You are kind of the main production promoter of this particular thing. You and your lovely wife, Aset. Okay. Yes. They have a studio here in Vegas where they put together shows and coordinate things. You're a choreographer. Right. And you met her as a choreographer? Yes. A long time? All right. Yes. Okay. In so Japan. is she teaching you how to dance? No. Don't tell me. <laughs> we don't want to hear anything else. That's it. No, I, I was just mesmerized looking. <laughs> oh, he was, he was a looker. Okay. Yeah, I, was, I was looking at that time. Okay. Now, so we uh, are here with the set. She is the uh, coordinating choreographer for the company. Yes. And you're more of the coordinating producer. And the two of you have three beautiful, great boys that are actually part of the company. Yes. And they've been put together with a couple of other guys that you guys put together. Yeah. Right? And therefore, mm -hmm. they become the Jackson Five, right? Yes. Okay. Yes, so right. we're gonna we're gonna see them a little bit too. Now, there's no one single tape other than the ones I brought that have just the Jackson Five on there. They're mainly the different acts, right? Right. Okay. So we're not gonna show that yet. Okay. So why don't you introduce your boys? Introduce your boys around so that the three boys, so that the okay. audience sees them and knows who's who. Well, first of all, we got the uh, older gentleman in the back. His name is Prince Laik. Say yeah. hi. And he's actually on his knees. He's not even standing. <laughs> <laughs> yes, uh, uh, he's a, a heck of an entertainer. Um, he likes to produce music uh, upcoming. And then we have um, uh, Mr. Spotlight, Prince Tahaka, over there. He's also an upcoming young producer, too. And all under the tutelage of Mr. Pilot, you know. And then we have the star of our show, which is uh, Prince Jahali. Say hi, Prince Jahali. Hello. Okay. <laughs> now, Prince actually is the one that is the Michael Jackson in the Jackson 5 show. Yes. Right? Yes. Okay. And then sitting next to them is the youngest of the boys. Yes. Oh, excuse me. Okay. <laughs> this here, this is Felton, right? Yes, sir. Felton yes. Pilot. And yeah. Felton Pilot has had a tremendous career in his life, and he's now he's jumped in and helping this new company. Yeah, he's a yeah. great guy. He's helping. The, he's also the musical director yes. and coordinator of a lot of the show concepts yes. and how it all comes together. I'm yes. sure how it fits. Whether you do a fast song or a slow song, and yeah. what songs work and what songs don't. Right. Yeah. Yep. He's so you're man. acting as an associate producer director, along yeah. with. You doing yes, it? You yes. all and you too, because you're I the choreographer, work together, right? Yes. Yeah. Okay. So everyone's working together now. Felton, how long have you been in Las Vegas? Uh, uh, let me see. I think I've signed my lease about about two months ago. <laughs> I've, been here, I've been here. We've been working with uh, Asar since what? Since what? November? Yeah. December. Okay. Yeah. And you've had a big career. Tell us some of the exciting things. My audience would like to know what Felton has been doing. Wow. Um, Just some of the great stuff. Don't be so, modest. So, uh, <laughs> okay, that's uh, enough. Thank uh, you. No, 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 okay. No. no. Um, <laughs> what, what I'm normally doing uh, is I, I still play with. I'm one of the original members of the group called Confunction. And we've been together since uh, 19... Okay. <laughs> I, I, I joined. <laughs> Just tell us, what is the name of the thing that you said? Uh, Confunction. Confunction? See, yes, we did uh, 10 albums for Polygram back in the 70s. Uh, now, what is Confunction? Tell us Con what that is. Confunction is a seven-piece band. We did 10 albums for Polygram back in the 70s and 80s. Have four gold albums on the Platinum album. Oh, that's uh, fantastic. You know, if you've heard of Earth, Wind, and Fire, if you haven't heard of Confunction, if you've heard of Earth, Wind, and Fire, they've played on my records. Oh, is that great? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's something else. Okay. okay. All right. Uh, so uh, what else are you doing now? You're, you're here in town and you're working with this great um, new company. Now, the company is called, uh, it's not just Las Vegas Stars, it's LVS 
Enterprise. Enterprise. Yes. LVS Enterprise. And you're affiliated with that company now. Yes. Uh, well, I guess that uh, SAR brought me in. Uh, uh, yeah, we started, I was first started talking late last you're year. You're like the parole yeah. officer of the board. <laughs> right. <laughs> Something like that. Or, or them of me. You know, yeah. Yeah, yeah, everyone okay. keeps everyone in line. And then the, the company itself is called Las Vegas Stars. Yes. Okay. yes. Actually, yeah, this, the group is called Las Vegas Stars. But real fast, let me go back. Uh, Mr. Potter has also done a lot of major, major things. Like, he's also have Grammy Award winners. He's a Grammy Award winner, sold over 50 million copies. He's also uh, produced one of the uh, the largest rap selling album in the world. Wow. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, no. Also, <laughs> he's also produced uh, MC Hammer, uh, Can't Touch This. Uh, he did the movie The Adams Family and working on the current soundtracks as we speak right now. So, well, how, how did so you attract such a him. superstar? <laughs> how did you get this guy? Well, you know, uh, 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 we're blessed to have him around because uh, 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 you know, for us, we need something like that in order for us to really move forward and, and, and have that professionalism behind us and with us, you know, it, it's like it's like a, unthought of. But uh, uh, we met uh, Mr. Pilot uh, through another good friend of ours by the name of uh, Miss Farah, you know, and we met him some years back and uh, we've been wanting to work with him ever since then and we finally got an opportunity and, and he had the time to uh, come and and give to us, and it was it was just it's been it's been it's been a, a climb every since. But Asar, just you yourself, and we're going to put the two of you here together. But even you yourself, you've been performing ever since you're a young guy too. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I, I, I got a couple of days in there. You got a couple of days in there. <laughs> you, you've been performing uh, now that you're 21. Uh, you've been performing with this with this lovely lady here, right? Yeah, and yeah. you guys have your own studio, and you're putting stuff together, and you do your own voice. Plus, you do tributes like to Marvin yeah. Gaye. Yeah. Right. Yeah. and other things and you do this great show together all of you do the show yeah. and uh, in that show uh, tell us some of the major besides the Jackson 5 now these guys only do the Jackson 5 in this particular right. show right yeah. okay yeah, besides this particular that, show. you and three other guys that we're gonna have in here in a little bit so don't leave us we're gonna have them here yeah. what are the other groups that you do well we do uh, all uh, groups all different genres of music but for this particular segment which is the mothership now which is the uh, uh, um, uh, the Motown Extreme Tribute or Review Show. Uh, we're doing the Temptations and the Four Tops for this particular group. But yeah, we do the uh, Drifters and the Four Tops and all this other kind of stuff too. And, and then you also the have a, a female group. There's four ladies and yes. there's four guys. Yes. It, it, okay, so there's four. Uh, there's five young guys, right? Yeah. Doing the Jackson Five. That's right. Then there's four other guys and then there's four ladies. And the yes. ladies are doing. We're going to have uh, one of those beautiful ladies uh, on this show. Yes. Absolutely yeah. gorgeous lady. Thank you for yeah. bringing her for me. Thank you. <laughs> yes, sir. Okay. Don't forget. That's for my brother Rod. <laughs> I have to bring in somebody. Oh, yeah. Okay, now, so you guys are all very talented, and you've been in other shows here in town. Yeah. Tell us some of the other things, Asar, that you have been doing. Well, I used to uh, uh, co-star uh, in the show at the Hitsville show. Um, Hitsville over at the uh, yeah. V Theater with yeah, David Sachs, that's right? That's right, yeah. And I did that show over there for seven and a half years, uh, um, the uh, uh, Hitsville show, and uh, it turned to be a success and it's still going. Yeah, still running. Yeah. Now you're doing your own show, yeah. Motown Extreme. It's yes. on the way. Yes. Yes, and I'm yeah. working to make sure we get this. Now, okay. What we decided to do with this particular show was we wanted to make sure that uh, um, uh, um, that we uh, do something that no other Motown show was doing. So we, t we decided to bring in all the big guns, you know, like we've been endorsed by Mr. P. Moore from Motown. Wow, that's awesome. Yeah, yeah. and uh, we brought and you have Felton. Mr. Felton. That's a big deal. You know. Yes, and then even the um, the uh, cast members, all the pros, have a long record and history of uh, uh, performing around the world and doing major things. So this particular uh, production here, uh, is, is we're taking it to a whole nother level. That's it's, right. That's what we call it, Motown Extreme. That's right. It is a non-stop, uh, unbelievable uh, entertainment uh, barrage of just yeah. great talent. Yeah, you know, yeah. and, and we're going to see some of that too because we do have a, a scissor reel of that to show in just yeah. a second. Yeah. Right now, we're going to show the first uh, uh, musical uh, video that we have. Go ahead, Scott, and play that for us and turn it over here so we can talk about it after we see it. Okay? okay. Thank you. You're going to love this.
Well, wow, that was pretty wild, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, no wonder you are in with this group here. I mean, these guys are awesome. The boys, they did great, right? Oh, yeah. They're just fantastic. Yeah, and the choreography, the things you're putting together, I think yes. they're going to keep you. That's what I heard. <laughs> <laughs> I heard you might stay in there. Okay. Yeah, well. <laughs> and if not, every month, don't worry about it. He has to pay you a big check. <laughs> so don't worry about it. It's not a big deal. Okay, so that was great, and I saw you yeah. doing Marvin Gaye in there and all yeah. those exciting things that, that everyone's doing. This is a great, great show, and I've been fortunate enough to produce some Motown shows here mm -hmm. in town uh, that played over at the Sahara and also played at the uh, mm -hmm. at the Rio okay. and so forth. And, of course, I used lots of Motown acts in the show Legends in Concert. Mm -hmm. Lots of them. Uh -huh. Always had some good Motown people mm -hmm. in there because that's that's the roots of the music. That's yes, where it all yes, came yes, from, right? Yes, right. Yes. That's it. That's it right there okay and so uh, this is an exciting thing it's an exciting time to be able to do that so how, how often do the boys work out as far as show business go in relationship to trying to adjust to life and school and all these things you, they're home taught right yeah there's home school home school <laughs> home school every yeah. day but every day they rehearse also Felton Pilot and Osard, they coach the vocals. Mm -hmm. They do. They so coach every humans. Day, they every day. Every, every day. Every single day. You guys have to do it every day? Yes. Yeah. Right. yeah. Have you ever thought of just <laughs> running away? <laughs> you know. There ain't nowhere to go. That's yeah. the way. They look like they're excited when they do something. Yeah, I'm going to teach you how to catch a train. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So all, all three of your boys are great singers. They're great people. I've known this group and this family here for some time. My fortune to get to know you today, and I'm going to get to know you for a long time. But I'm part of the family. That's right. Don't right. deny it, okay? That's right, man. That's right. All right. <laughs> <laughs> you don't be me, huh? Uncle, Uncle Steve, right? <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, we're going to find a great room for this show. And we're already yeah. talking to some rooms. And I'm sure that in the next few weeks, this show will be open and going strong. That's right. That's okay? right. We're going to make right. this happen. Yes. It's going to be exciting. And uh, that that the uh, whole thing is just going to be an accomplishment that came from a couple that got together and and not only made whoopee, but also made <laughs> happy <laughs> shows and all this kind of stuff. And these three great boys. Yeah. And I've been over there and yeah, these guys work their little tails off. They are great. Yeah, 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 yeah they, they are. are. But you teach other people, too. You're actually an open academy. Right. And if people want to find out about AIP... Academy, Academy of, of, of the, the Arts. Arts. Right. AIP Arts. Academy of the Arts. It's on Eastern, right? That's right. Uh, and between, it's uh, across streets are Eastern and Patrick, 6000 South Eastern Avenue, Suite 3B, Las Vegas, Nevada. Yeah. 89119. Just south of Oquindo. <laughs> just south of Oquindo on Eastern. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And it's a great studio. So any of you parents or you young people that want to get and involved in two great people that are dedicated and bring in great people like uh, uh, Mr. Felton here uh, and he's also a pilot because that's his last name. <laughs> he actually does it but he actually is a pilot. Okay so Felton pilot and, and so you've brought notary notoriety into your group and, yeah. and uh, so it's great and that's exciting. Okay yeah. so this is going to be a fun time, a fun yeah. show and you other people that want to sing and dance and do things and get into shows you want to contact AIP Academy of the Arts yeah. and that's a great thing and all of you people want to be looking for the show from Las Vegas Stars and LV Enterprise, yeah. LBS right. Enterprise, LBS Enterprise, LBS Enterprise you want to be looking for the show called Motown Extreme Dot Tribute. Com. Yeah. They can go online also and see the website. But they can go online and see Motown Extreme Dot com. Dot com. That's okay. Right. Yeah. MotownExtreme.com. You don't want to miss that. Yeah. Now, right now, we have another little tape we're going to play for you because these guys are also the young boys are working on another show, and that show is going to come about here pretty quick, too. We're all working on it, uh, and that show is called MJ Evolution. And we're going to play you that for you right now, Scott. You got that ready? Yeah. And you're going to see these guys kick it up again because this is a great group. Here All we right. go.
You would not believe how fast those boys grew up. This is the same guy that were here just a minute ago. This set back here, same guy. This is the one that did Michael Jackson. The, the little kid, right? Yeah. It's amazing. The, these guys, whoop, like that. That's a big. Okay. Well, it's what we did here. While we had a little teeny break while you were watching the video, we had some of the other superstars of the show come in that do some of the other groups in this thing. Okay? And uh, one of them, we had Chester over here. Chester back here. You see in here? And if any of you guys get a chance to talk you want to talk real loud right in get close to the mic and talk Hello. in there okay and then we also have uh, Mark yes sir. Mark over here yes. okay and then behind me we have mr. William Jordan That's right. okay all right so uh, Chester how did you get in this group what happened well first of all I've, I've heard about it in here now I've heard about it and I'm very glad to be with it because this is gonna be the number one thing keep your eyes open ears open this is gonna be it it's going to be it. Okay. A All whole, right. A whole new chapter. Yeah. Well, <laughs> Beats pushing a shopping cart. <laughs> That's what I say. <laughs> yes, indeed. I actually <laughs> like my shopping cart. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Anyway, so then, Mark, how did you get in the group? You've been, actually, I've known you a while. Yes, yes. And, and how long have you been doing this kind of thing where you've been singing in groups? How long? Quite a bit. What time is it now, John? <laughs> About five minutes? <laughs> no, a long time, a long time. Um, and the reason I got into this group, I've been knowing Rob a long time. I, I saw it. And um, I think it's, it's it, it, to me personally, it's good to work with professionals, you know, and dedicated people. And, and that's, that's why you brought Felton in the group. <laughs> <laughs> he's one of the added attractions. He's, he's, believe me, he's, he's professional and he's very right. knowledgeable. Yeah. All right. He's, it's great to have a superstar, but you're all superstars. And you all Correct. actually pay tribute to superstars. Correct. Yeah. It's amazing, all the Motown music and what it does to people and what it does. Now, the guy behind me looking over my shoulder, how did you get in here? You're just kind of young compared to some of these guys. How did you get in here? Well, um, Sarah and I have a mutual friend who told me about this uh, yeah. project and um, I was more than inter interested in getting into it um, I love the music I love to perform and um, it was a great opportunity for me so I started working with them and here we are now you've been singing since when since high school since junior college how, how long have you been singing uh, I've been singing a long time I, I come from a mus musical family although it's mainly gospel and blues uh, I've been singing since I probably about three years old so it's been a long, long time, um, and I'm older than I look. <laughs> he told me, he personally told me you were not over 65. <laughs> That's true. Okay. That part was true. <laughs> okay, so through friendship and through other things, you assembled all these people, and you guys all got together, and you're doing this great show. This is a great T-shirt. I want to show this T-shirt yeah. here. Okay, That's kind of the logo. Uh, of their show, right? Yes. Okay, yes, and, and you sir. can see that on some of the video we're doing. Uh, the only thing good about this T-shirt at this time is you cannot see my face. I know that's what you like. Okay. So surprise! Oh, okay. Anyway, that's great. Okay, that's a beautiful T-shirt right there. Yes. Okay. Yes. So and you have great posters. You have great marketing. You have great videos. You have all kinds of great things happening yeah. uh, to the group. Okay. Now before you join this group. Uh, William, what did you do before that? I mean, what were you in some other groups doing that? I'm trying to make you a superstar here. <laughs> we can get rid of all these people. <laughs> no, uh, yeah, yeah, before I uh, joined this group, I did sing in a lot, some other groups. I was with an R&B group called Serenade. We actually had a recording contract with Barry Gordy, so, uh, um, Gilbert Music. Um, I've done a lot of stuff on my own as a solo artist. <laughs> um, I've, I've done a lot of stuff around L.A. and in Kentucky and, and here now. So now you're excited to be in this group. I'm very. I'm excited to have opportunity to show and uh, share the gift that God's given me. So wherever oh, that great. is. So now, now look. No, you got to look at Asar. Somehow you're responsible for assembling this group. It's your studio, and you're the only one that carries a gun. So we know that, that, that none of these guys would be I here without you. your protection. <laughs> it's a water pistol. <laughs> okay, so how did you pick these guys? Did you want? To, is there anything special that you you used to go with? I mean, I produced and had to direct and put together a lot of shows, but you got to really feel that they got that talent, that they've got everything it takes to make it happen. Well, f for, uh, first of all. Um, I was uh, um, with a lot of groups in my life, and um, uh, when we were young, we performed in groups like Seville, 
where when we um, were in the uh, dressing room, we had fun. We laughed, we joked, we, we, we had, it was a real camaraderie with one another, you know. And um, there was a lot of groups that I ended up performing with after that, you know, a few, that turned out to be some really stressful groups. You know, where people were, didn't really like each other. It was like, you know, it was really uh, not a fun place to be. And you mean your group, the singing and what you were doing, it wasn't a fun thing well, to do? You know, it, it was the, the singing was fun and the stage was fun, but it was like certain people didn't have a camaraderie. It's like performing with people yeah. who, who you didn't really... But, but prison is like that. <laughs> it's always like that. What would you hey, expect? Hey, look here. We had a, we had a gig... In that, yeah, we had a gig. We had a gig out in Japan. It was a turned out to be a very uh, profitable profitable uh, uh, endeavor. Um, but me and Andrea uh, Brown, she was Barry, uh, uh, Barry White's drummer. Uh, anyway, beautiful woman. Anyway, we called that the gig from hell. It was, it was so stressful. It was like, my goodness, this is a beautiful thing, but it's turned to stress. Now, my point for saying that is when we, when we formed this group here, we wanted to make sure that we form a group with like minds and people who really liked each other and who really get along and 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 we well, sometimes we be in there like kids we be laughing we got Mark here we call him Senor de Marquez <laughs> <laughs> you know he be cracking jokes Chester cracking jokes William he crack a little joke or two you know I throw my little uh, bit in there and, and we having fun it's like we're kids again and it's not about the money though we will make a lot of money in this uh, endeavor it's not about that it's about the love of the art and the craft, and we really enjoy being around one another. That's other. great. That's great. Mm -hmm. right. yeah. Let me ask Scott. Scott, do you have another tape that's not MJ Evol I mean, not the, not the original one, but do you have another tape there to play? Yeah, I have, um, play it. Or yeah, play it. Well, now you see what it's like behind the scenes. Pretty wild, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's wild, all right. Okay. So that's actually inside your rehearsal studio, too, over yes. at AIP IP Academy, of Academy of the Arts. That's okay? right. Okay? Over on Eastern. Well, you're going to learn a lot from that. And then this new show they've just all put together, uh, we've had some people call in and they want to see that video again. Mm. Okay? Yeah, so right. I charge them $2,000. I keep it. You get nothing. Okay. <laughs> it's a good thing. I love it. Okay. <laughs> it sounds like a deal, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Who's going to take it? William. He's got his hand in my pocket right now. <laughs> okay. All right. So anyway, so we're going to see some great stuff here. It's a great show. Uh, did you, sir, Mr. Felton, did you... You say want to say anything that you haven't been able to say yet? There's been a a, a joy that I felt working with these guys. Isn't that um, great? There's yeah. uh, one of the wonderful things that helped in Confunction's longevity was the fact that we were as a family. You know, mm -hmm. at the point we when, when we left, we were all from Vallejo, California, uh, but we all went out on the road. We left Vallejo and moved to Memphis, Tennessee. At that point, we, the seven of us, now had to depend on each of the rest of us. Pretty much, you know, that that was now our livelihood. That that at that point became music became our only source of income, and we were dependent on 
each other, right? You, you developed a bond and a love and an appreciation for ex each other. Exactly. Yeah. And That's I, awesome. And I feel that with, with this group here, which makes it a, a, a real joy to work with. That's awesome. Okay, mm -hmm. so the only one that really spoils the whole thing is... <laughs> <laughs> Wait. That's it. Why do you pick on me? <laughs> we got to pick on somebody. No movie is without somebody being picked on. <laughs> okay, so this is exciting, and you're all very talented. Yeah. You're all very strong and doing this. Did any of you want to say something you haven't had this, uh, been able to say yet? But you want to make sure you look up the show, MotownExtreme.com. Yes. And we're going to show another yes. little video of it yes. in, in a second. Okay. okay, did any of you want to say something you haven't got to say yet? I, actually, I just wanted this is on a personal level. Nice to be with you, John. Well, you guy. <laughs> nice you I've known this guy quite a while. Yes, sir. Yes, right. sir. Yes, yes sir. Important. He's my brother from another mother. <laughs> There's no question about it. <laughs> okay, so we've been actually. I've worked with these guys for here, here and there for different people. Mm -hmm. And uh, meet your daddy. Okay, thank you. Okay. <laughs> so we're gonna play that Motown Extreme one more time. Then we're gonna have one more new group come in here that's gonna just completely. It's a a new kind of a toy. I'll, I'll show you in a minute. <laughs> okay, <laughs> here we go.
Wow, look at a whole new family once again. Here we are. Wow, we are back here again, and we have a beautiful set, our choreographer for this great show, uh, Motown Extreme. And we have Asar here, associate producer, and they are the owners and operators of the AIP Academy of the Arts. That is the home base, kind of, for these yeah. shows here. Yeah. And who's that good-looking guy right next to you, Asset? Who's that? <laughs> yes. yeah. Which one did you notice had the talent first? The first one that was born, or did they kind of all, those five kids, I mean, those three boys, when they did it, did, did one kind of uh, do it ahead of the other one? Yeah, the older boy, he started, and then everybody else, they started out doing each other. Yeah. The first sign was when they was born. That was the first sound hit. Well, that's because you slapped them with right. that. Hey. Hey. Yeah. Yeah. Couldn't help but say. That's, that's, yeah. that's, that's right. That. That's okay. right. Okay. Now, uh, so Rod, don't worry about this. I told you I was going to have a toy on stage. Uh, that that her, <laughs> toy. This is toy. <laughs> and she's one of the beautiful girls that is in the show. Okay. And what are the tributes you do? You do Gladys Knight no. and the Pips. Uh, no, I personally don't do Gladys. I do the. Supreme. No, but the but you're in the group. Is it, yeah, but well, yeah. you're in the group of the Supremes. Yes. And I'm what else? Is that it? And Tony Braxton now. Tony Braxton. Mm -hmm. Do you do Tony Braxton? Mm -hmm. You are the Tony Braxton. Mm -hmm. You know, that's beautiful. You're a beautiful lady, and yeah. I think you do that very well. Thank okay. You. Yes. And uh, he told me he's going to hit on you. So I just want to. <laughs> I'm just trying to let him. Between me okay. And that. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I'm trying to. I'm never going. Not gonna. my muffin. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, these guys are fantastic talent. Now, Toy, uh, her name really was Latoya, right? Yeah. Okay. And somebody nicknamed you Toy. Yeah. Yeah, I met him. Anyway. Yeah. <laughs> He doesn't play with me anymore now. <laughs> so, how long have you been entertaining? Toy, how long have you been entertaining? Um, honestly, since I was like 11 years old. And how long have you known this beautiful family here? That now you're all one family. I know that, but until then, how how long have you known this family here? I started with this production now, probably about six months ago. Six months ago, mm -hmm. and how did you hear about it? Uh, goodness, I don't know how I came across the audition. It was it was honestly I just kind of put it out there like you know I want to find um, a, a group that you know I could sing with and, or entertainment I want to get back into it and then all of a sudden I came across this audition. How long have you? Oh, it was an audition. So you guys held auditions. Yes. Oh really? Yeah. 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 Bass, okay. So bass in Las yeah. Vegas. No, yeah. that's yes. did you, you did you held the dance yeah. audition? Yes. And mm -hmm. you held the the performance and the singing mm -hmm. and all that kind of yes. stuff. Okay. Yeah. Now mm -hmm. you told me I couldn't audition because you thought I would stand out too much. I don't know what he meant by that. We're going to let it go. Too tall. Okay. Too tall. Too tall. Too tall. Too tall. <laughs> so, anyway, so you came in. How did you hear about the audition? I honestly don't remember. I just remember... You saw his picture in the post office? Probably. <laughs> I think that was it. Yeah. And, and, I, and I sent in my pictures and, you know, whatever was required, and they called me back, and I went in, and I still didn't know exactly to what extreme it was, you know, but mm -hmm. I was like, I'm just going to try, and it turned out to be Motown Extreme. And, and how, long have you lived, how long have you lived in Vegas? Oh, my goodness. Years. <laughs> I grew up here. Oh, you grew up here? Yeah, I grew I've up been here 35 years. 
Yeah. I've been here yeah. about, <laughs> about that. About that. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, there's a lot of great things going on right now. And what's the other ladies' names that are in the show? Well, we want to make sure we recognize them. Uh, who's the other th uh, three girls that are in the, your groups? So we have Marquis, who uh -huh. does Diana. We have Patrice, who does Gladys Knight. And then we also have Luana. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And you do the uh, Marvin Gaye with Gladys Knight, right? Uh, yes, we do, do a Marvin Gaye. Yeah, yeah. And don't you do a duet with her too? Yeah, we are uh, actually putting the duet in there now. But uh, yeah, we do a duet. Uh huh. Yeah. yeah. So we're doing all this fun stuff at the yeah. studio there, and this holds it all together. And yeah. the, he musically, Felton, he holds it all together. Yes. You got the the guy with the strength and to come in here and add the glue that holds mm -hmm. it together, mm -hmm. and and then you guys add the charisma and the excitement and the creativity, mm -hmm. and together you're a unified effort called Motown Extreme, yes. right? And yeah. you guys don't want to miss this, so you want to get on your website, you want to look up MotownExtreme.com. And all of you that have kids or family or older people that want to get into the show business, you want to go contact AIP Studio of the Arts. That's right. And that's Academy, right yeah. again, Academy, Academy of, of the Arts. Of the arts. Yes. Mm -hmm. Academy yeah. of the Arts, mm -hmm. right. Yeah. And that's over there <laughs> on Eastern, okay? Right south of Oquendo. Yeah, Just well, actually right on the corner of Eastern and Patrick. Yeah. Right on the corner. No. Matter of fact, directly across the street from Bank of America yeah. and Walmart. Walmart. That's right. right. Mm -hmm. And la that's where I met them. I normally stand on that corner with a cup <laughs> and I have a shopping basket and they say hi to me every day. And it's, it's a wonderful thing. You guys are that nice. Okay. Where's our little, uh, does our little Michael Jackson come back in here? Hey. Yeah. Oh, here you are, dude. Well, listen, why don't you guys, you want to sing a, a little duet? Little thing, come on. What are we gonna? We got to close this thing with something, huh? <laughs> huh? Okay, um, let's take a time. Okay, go for it. Oh, we get close here. Right here. <coughs> come here, baby. Come here. Okay. Here we go. Gonna see a couple little singing here. She go. You take the first verse. Oh, boy. Oh, you take it off first. Oh, okay. First. Let's take our time tonight, girl. Above us all the stars are watching There's no place I'd rather be in this world Your eyes are where I'm lost in Underneath the chandelier We're dancing all alone there's no reason to hide what we're feeling inside right now. So baby, let's just turn down the lights and close the door. Ooh, I love that dress, but you won't need it anymore. No, you won't need it no more. Let's just kiss till we make it, baby. <laughs> Versace on the floor. All right. You better hey, go, well, boy. It. Is that a singing family or not? Why was I holding up that mic? Were you singing there, guy? Were you singing? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah. Now, all right, now. <laughs> we want to say we love this family. Now it's a new family mm -hmm. called Motown Extreme and also Las Vegas Stars, mm -hmm. right? And LV. Yes, Enterprise, and they're all here together. I love them all. You watch for them because you're going to see them on a major stage here in Las Vegas, Motown Extreme, in just a few weeks. You watch for it. That's right. Thank you all. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye.